Yeah, I have a friend on YouTube. We have a lot of conversations back and forth. And he keeps commenting yesterday, Daft Bugger commented about Dawkins and how I need to read this. Or was it Carl Sagan? Excuse me. Now, Carl Sagan was not a new atheist. I realize that. The new atheist, atheist or um, the late Chris Hitchens was a new atheist. Sam Harris, I, I would say Dawkins is a part of that. And they are a new movement within atheism. Madeline Murray O'Hara was a famous atheist when I was a kid. I know because I was in Christian fundamentalism at the time and they talked about her. I don't really know much about her. What I'll tell you some things on my observations of the new atheist. Number one, I, I don't trust them. No, I don't trust them. They seem to be very angry, very shrill. And one thing that, I, that I'm suspicious about is that Mr. Hitchens, I saw him arguing with Jewish people, arguing with Muslims, arguing with Christians, and I have no problem with him doing this to make money and to, for him to have money. I don't have a problem with that. But one day, I'm on the YouTube, and I see him talking about his mother being Jewish and how he's a Jewish mother and who he was. And then he was explaining how his, his daughter was being christened, not christened was the wrong word, but was being some kind of ceremony where she was going into a Jewish synagogue and he was talking about his Jewishness. And it just seemed kind of strange. Why is this guy talking about his Jewishness when he's an atheist all over the place? It didn't make sense to me and I don't know if that's on there. I don't think I dreamed it. And it seems strange to me that Harris and the rest of these guys don't seem to have any problem with going after Muslims and being hatred and stirring that up. To me, they are just shills for the military industrial complex and they're dishonest. And I think there's some kind of connection between the military industrial complex and modern Zionism. I do, I can't prove it, but that's what I think. I think they're, they're connected and I don't trust them. Um, as far as being an atheist, I don't see it. I don't see it. I think there's way too much. The universe is way too complicated and I have far too little information to make a conclusion like that to be an atheist. Way too much. Uh, did we evolve? Is evolution a fact? As Carl Sagan said, evolution is a fact. Yes, I think it's a fact. I think it's obvious. It's obvious that evolution is real. Uh, but is that, a, is that what God used to make create the earth? Yeah, that makes sense. But I don't know. I don't see anything worth getting all that upset about. And I don't trust those guys. Don't trust them as far as I can throw them. They seem to be way too much in the pocket of what Chris Hedges called the religion of hate. That's what Chris Hedges called him. He called him out and said they were full of the religion of hate. And I think he is. And I'm not saying that any of the above religions are religions of hate. I am not qualified to speak to that. I'm all, only qualified to say that I'm suspicious of modern Zionism and the military industrial complex as I see it today. Have they done good things in the world? Yeah. Are they pure evil? No, I don't believe in pure evil. Am I unqualified to say? Uh, yeah. Uh, do I put two and two together? In other words, number one, um, Chris, I mean, Christopher Hitchens is talking about how bad religion is. Number two, he's over there getting his daughter and proud of his daughter becoming a, a real Jew. Yeah, that's a little crazy. I don't quite get it. That don't add up. All right. Check my facts if you'd like. Bye-bye.